clothing and medical supplies for refugees from Ukraine has been met with an overwhelming response in Halifax, where hundreds of drivers have been queuing up all day to help the cause. A farmhouse there has been filling up with supplies ready to be shipped out on Friday. Chris Kiddy has been there all day. They've been queuing all day in the mist and rain, up to 30 cars at a time, their drivers waiting to make their donations. Buy more, please, Tony! It was so busy, in fact, they had to have a traffic control scheme. Well, I was amazed when I got up here, because it's a kind of out-of-the-way place in the fog and the rain on the top of the moor, you know. But we're, I mean, really heartwarming, isn't it? I am a little bit surprised, yeah, but I've also got a bit of restoration faith in humanity, don't I? Next door neighbour, Lithuania. So it's very sad that it's happened. It's, uh, I'm very emotional. Clothing is next door. If you've got any time for bedding, our toiletries will be coming. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. For Maria Power, this is personal. The collection point of farmhouse was her grandparents' home. They came here from Ukraine. Mama, mama, mama. She, like everyone else driven to help, has been moved to action by the pictures of desperate refugees fleeing the fighting there now. It's heartbreaking, really, is seeing all them children, everybody having to flee. Um, it's a hard to place to your heart because that's where your family is from. Every room in this house now, though, is filling up with donations, which it's hoped will make a difference. Today has been unbelievable. We've had people queuing outside with the cars. We've had loads of people from across the community um, coming to volunteer. It's just been overwhelming. It's personal too for Mick. His family also come from Ukraine. It's uh, a, a massive, a massive turnout of, of donations. It's, it's unbelievable. The collection has been helped by an appeal put out by a sports club just a few miles away. Members there today not lifting weights but bags of donations. We put out an email to the board members and we were going to give any donations to help us out, payment taken out, and the response has been fantastic. Yeah, we've got medical and uh, hygiene products, toothpaste, brushes. And still the supplies come. The first container load will head out from Halifax on Friday. Amazing.